The Hunger Games, parking at Monmouth University. Welcome to Monmouth University, a smaller scale university with 6,034 students enrolled. However, the problem at hand is the parking. 59% of students live off of campus and commute to Monmouth University, according to the Monmouth University Handbook. According to Monmouth University's Outlook, Volume 84, Fall 2012, Spring Semester, University administrators estimate that there are currently 1,554 non-residential parking spots and roughly 4,000 non-residential students. Therefore, where is the space to park? It's terrible, there's too many people, not enough parking spaces, and I think that they need to figure out a solution soon. How long on average do you spend looking for a spot? I've looked for a spot for like 35 minutes once. And how would you say the parking situation is? Does mom have to get into consideration how many students they're accepting and how many students are parking? I don't think they take into consideration the, what you just said, amount of people coming in but I do think that they're trying to find a way to alleviate parking. One of the ways I know they are alleviate parking is by making grad students go to the graduate school instead of coming here for their classes. What's a recommendation that you have for Mama with the parking situation? Make a parking garage. Thank you for your time. Students all over Monmouth do you agree with the provisions of having a parking garage. According to the City of Long Branch Codes, Section 345-42, Parking garages, or vertical parking garages, shall be treated as an accessory building within the zone of district of its location. However, setback shall be a minimum of 30 feet from any property line or the height of the structure, whichever is the greater. Hey Mike, How, so you're on SGA. How would you say the parking situation is at Monmouth? Uh, parking situation is pretty difficult. We got a lot of students to deal with. We also have limited space in terms of the parking. We can't really. We're not a big university. We don't have the expansion space like Rutgers or say would have. So it's a difficult like balance on how do we accept more students and still at the same time balance our current students and at the other same time provide parking for all of them and during the highest you know, traffic times. Have you found that there's problems with the valet service? Uh, Generally, when there's issues, they get addressed in the SJ meetings, and VP Nagy has been pretty good at it, you know, making sure they're fixed or addressed. We've been able to change valet time. So, and we've got a new company this year, and they've been working out pretty well. So. And what are some recommendations you have to alleviate the situation? Uh, recommendations? Well, first would probably be to pave the back lot in 18. That's a pretty bad shape. I've had students come to me blowing tires in there. they got potholes pretty big. Uh, so that's a pretty big area. Uh, but it's just expanding. Like we have this, we don't have the space. That's really the problem. So. Well, thank you for your time. Oh, you're very welcome. Very happy to help. How would you say the parking at Monmouth University is horrible? There absolutely needs to be more spaces for students. I spend about a half hour. I, have, I live a block, and I'm leaving 40 minutes before class just to get a spot. It's Have crazy. you ever witnessed a car accident? Two girls in my sorority, and I'm at least five throughout the course of my time here. Now I'm a senior. Would you say that Mammoth produces the parking lot well? I'm sorry, no. I love Mammoth, but they're not the best at that. What do you recommend Mammoth does to fix the situation? Well, I know that Mammoth has a lot of money that they implement into different departments of the school, so I wish that they would expand the lot or create a, a lot with different levels or extend the valet from just the lot by the communications building into the lot by Bay Hall and planned here also. That'd be nice. How would you say the valets are? Have you heard complaints? The valet system's pretty good. I don't have any complaints with them, but sometimes when the weather's bad, they take a long time and you're waiting in the cool train, so sometimes you just figure it's better to park your own car, so it kind of depends on the day. Thank you for your time. Yeah.